What's up, what's up, what's up? It's your girl, Miss Montana. <laughs> Y'all know, okay? So let's get right into it. I heard about this book. We gonna read this book together. It's very short, real short, small, small chapters look, like little paragraphs. It's probably fiction and nonfiction. I ain't gonna lie, I don't remember the difference between the two. <laughs> But that's not the point. We gonna read it. Child, I heard like one paragraph or one chapter. I don't even know because I just got the book, but someone was reading it online. And I was like, oh no, I need to get this for myself because I need to see what's in it. That's just really it. We gonna get right into it, okay? We gonna go chapter by chapter, okay? Like I said, all the chapters are short. Look how small this book is okay like it's paper thin okay it's giving stick man hang man as a book okay here we go <laughs> kim's lost words okay by jamal millwood okay for kimberly porter now supposedly this is from her little drive you know if anybody knows anything about anything she supposedly was supposed to be writing a book a tell-all book and she was putting information you know here and there and before her passing she put some stuff or all of it i don't know on some thumb drives and gave them out to like some friends and things like that supposedly the person that wrote this book jamal was given the thumb drive from whoever kim gave the thumb drive to and if you don't know who kim or kimberly porter is it is P. Diddy, Puff Daddy Combs, Dr. Love, the Diddler's ex, who oh, passed away mysteriously. Well, I think she had a real reason for passing, but you know, for some people, it's definitely giving mysterious. Okay, so let's just <laughs> let y'all look at it. Let y'all look at it real quick, real quick, real quick. <laughs> okay. Chapter one, let's go. Oh, we're going to read the disclaimer, okay? And I got to keep the book real neat because I'm trying to send it back to Amazon before 30 days, okay? Like, <laughs> not for real, like, I'm like, okay, disclaimer. One of Kim Porter's, I, I can't even read. Let me sip some tea because I don't believe I have a master's degree. I couldn't even say Porter. I couldn't read the... I couldn't read the second word. That's ridiculous. I don't know what the tea is going to do, but I'm just going to drink it. Makes me feel sophisticated. I almost spilled the tea, Lord. Let me just get to the book. All right. So let's see. Disclaimer. One of Kim Porter's final wishes was for this memoir Oh, memoir. No, it's memoir. I might need to read out loud because clearly I can't read out loud. We're going to start over again. This is embarrassing. <laughs> embarrassing. Disclaimers. One of Kim Portal's... <laughs> Why do I keep saying portal? I'm actually getting upset. Hold on. I might have to skip that sentence, y'all. It's stressing me out, okay? Don't tell nobody. Miss Montana can't read. Let's try again. Page one. Disclaimers. One of Kim Porter's final wishes was for this memoir diary to be made public. Out of protection for certain parties and their potential criminal activity, some celebrities, performers, and events have been represented with exes due to their highly explosive nature. At some point in the future, this information will be revealed to the public. Regarding Kim's sudden death, and the mysterious illness of Albie Shore and Jamie Foxx, evidence does exist that points to foul play and or poisoning. And then it says, God bless Kim Porter and all of Sean Combs' victims, both male and female. So there's apparently 19 chapters. Real short, real short, don't forget. Chapter one is the introduction. Chapter two, humble beginnings. Chapter three, second chances. Chapter four, forgiveness. Chapter five, Sean Neal's. Chapter six, Pac. Chapter seven, threats. Chapter eight, Kidada. Chapter nine, going back to Cali. Chapter 10, the lies you tell. Chapter 11, mo problems. 
Chapter 12, A Mama's Love. Chapter 13, Have Some Faith. Chapter 14, Outshine. And that's S-H-Y-N-E, like shine. So that chapter might have something to do with shine. Chapter 15, Queen Biatch. Chapter 16, Christian. Chapter 17, Broken Promises. Chapter 18, Sweet Goodbyes. Chapter 19, Finale. So here we go with chapter one, introduction for today. <laughs> Soon after high school, I started landing modeling jobs. I couldn't believe it. It was all happening so fast. I met my husband, father of my oldest child, and one of my oldest friends in life, I'll be sure. It was a whirlwind romance. I was only 19 when we married, and no, it didn't work out. Al is still one of my best friends to this day. Our son Quincy is such a talented and wonderful young man. At that time, I had no idea my relationship with Al was going to introduce me to the man that I would spend the better part of my adult life with, a man whom I would love and cherish, but eventually fear and hate. I don't want to put the cart before the horse, but I will say, although I knew what was going on, I turned a blind eye many times. Here, I have to tell this truth, unfortunately, because deep down, I knew everything that was happening, but I lied to myself a lot. He was so charming, a wolf in sheep's clothing, a devil, and I fell for it. This story must be told, despite the fact it will hurt my children. I cannot hide it any longer. Sean Combs must be stopped. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, <laughs> like, share, subscribe, whatever they say at the end of the videos <laughs> so you can get chapter two.